So my name is Chid Apte. I'm director of the analytics research function within the Math Sciences Organization. So our center within the Math Sciences Organization is responsible for conducting basic and applied research in a broad spectrum of what you might want to think of as quantitative analysis fields, statistics, machine learning, data mining, decision analysis, stochastic analysis. Um, the department itself uh, works across a broader set of activities related to mathematics and the applications of mathematics, hence the name mathematical sciences. So in addition to our data analytics and stochastic analysis functions, we obviously have a lot of interest in adjacent areas like operations research, optimization, simulation, and modeling. So it's kind of the entire gamut of applied math that I think where we invest in the, in the center. The math sciences department was created in 1960 in IBM research, and Dr. Herman Goldstein was our first director. Uh, Dr. Goldstein came to lead the Math Sciences Organization in IBM Research after working on the ENIAC computer, which was one of the first modern digital computers invented. And uh, the kind of uh, approaches he took in applying mathematical ideas to the design and engineering of the ENIAC computer kind of uh, set the space and tone for how the Math Sciences Organization in IBM Research would carry forward in terms of applying mathematical sciences ideas to innovations in information technology. Hi, my name is Baruch Schieber and I manage the Optimization Center, which is part of the Business Analytics and Mathematical Sciences Department here at IBM TJ Watson Research Center. I would like to encourage you to submit your application to the Herman Goldstein Postdoctoral Fellowship which uh, we have, uh, this is a competition that we, a, a competitive postdoctoral fellowship that we run in the department on a yearly basis. Usually we select two awardees to this uh, prestigious uh, fellowship, and uh, usually also we allow the awardee to stay here for up to two years. So if you want to leave after a year, you are more than welcome to, but we will also give you uh, the, 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 the opportunity to stay for a second year. I, I find the environment and the postdoc very exciting. As a matter of fact, I myself uh, is a past postdoc. Uh, then it was not called the Hermann Goldstein postdoc, but it was the same uh, postdoctoral fellowship program that the department has been running for more than 20 years. I am here more than 20 years. and You see, I'm still smiling, so it seems that it's a good choice. It has been a good choice. One of the unique, uh, I think, uh, characteristics of this place is this uh, synergy and mix of uh, working on real-life projects and being exposed to business optimization problems that are in the marketplace with a lot of basic research that we are doing here. And I, my feeling is that it, this is one of the only places in the world where we can get this exposure to both sides. On one hand, to be exposed to state-of-the-art basic research, and on the other hand, to be uh, to, to have the access and, and, and also the opportunity to participate in projects that are very advanced with some of the largest uh, of IBM customers in the world. And uh, myself, I find both sides of this work very exciting, and especially for someone that comes from academia and uh, probably has not had the chance to experience the other side of career before making a decision which career to take, maybe continue with academic life or continue more in the business arena. This is a very good uh, opportunity and a way to see both sides. As a postdoctoral fellowship, you will have the opportunity to collaborate with the people in the department, but one of the nice things of this uh, a competitive fellowship is the uh, freedoms that you get. So if if you decide to, to pursue your own research agenda, you will be more than welcome to, but personally I would suggest that when you are here you try to leverage on the people and the researchers here to get uh, and, and basically to collaborate with them. But again, this is up to you. If you are awarded this fellowship, uh, you, you, you have the, all the freedom in, in, in this sense. So let me just uh, conclude by saying that we accept application starting at around October and I would encourage you to look on the web for the formal announcement which will detail the deadline for a submission and what we need as part of this submission. So good luck.